my name is Rachel and I love clothes and today what I'm doing is it's, the weather is getting nicer the Sun is out and shining and it's been warming up so I thought I would do a gothic spring lookbook but with the little twist of all the clothes that you're going to see in this lookbook I found thrifting so we're starting off really simple and easy this is a nice casual everyday outfit uh, this is a nice little black top from Torrid and then these denim jeans with these uh, what's that called sequins they're the knees and they are a skinny jean and they're nice and stretchy also by Torrid and then I am wearing up here closer one of my scale chokers with uh, the little pentagrams and uh, onk. <laughs> so this is my first casual spring outfit, all thrifted. Well, I made the necklace, but mostly thrifted. <laughs> and let's move on to another one. Okay, so I guess I do need a disclaimer. I don't think any of my accessories are thrifted. It's only the clothing pieces that are thrifted. <laughs> Uh, but I also uh, forgot to, to mention I am wearing my Werewolf Green contacts from Coal Eyes. They did send them to me for free for review. And um, yeah. Oh, and I really need to, to re dye my hair, but <laughs> I was like, I don't know. The, the almost pastel purpley blues is kind of Easter egg ish. It's spring. <laughs> So I'm just kind of going with it, even though it desperately needs a touch-up. <laughs> but here we go. So next up is this great little flutter, sheer lined dress by Pretty Garden that was thrifted. And then I paired that with some accessories to give it, you know, a little bit more of a fun look. I do have a purple witch hat with uh, one of the scale hat bands that I make. And then I have, I have this super fun harness that has wings so I can feel like a gothic spring fairy <laughs> and then I have these little cuffs I love these cuffs they're just little ruffly cuffs <laughs> and all of these I would also just wear with one of my pairs of comfortable orthopedic Mary Jane shoes because you guys know I have the foot issues so I don't get to wear the fun shoes anymore <laughs> but I do have some cute little orthopedic Mary Janes that I wear with everything so yeah this is Outfit number two, let's move on. So my third outfit, both of these clothing pieces were thrifted. It is another torrid top. And then this skirt is by a company called Bon Apple Tea. <laughs> like the tea you sip. <laughs> so I think that's a cute name. But the uh, the skirt is um, angle length. It does go touch the tops of my feet. And it's got gray with these bats all over it. So I think it's super cute. And I just tucked in this torrid shirt with it. And then I added a, what's that called? <laughs> Again, a pentagram, pentacle. <sighs> I was told the difference. I've already forgotten the difference. So I'll just keep calling them pentagrams. <laughs> but um, yeah, so I, I just dressed that up with uh, this uh, little pentagram and chain harness, which is super cute. And I believe the harness was from Temu. So let me know what you've been thinking about my spring goth outfit so far down in the comments below which one's been your favorite so far and we only have two more to try i'll be right back so this next thrifted dress you probably recognize from uh, one of my gothic cruise uh, lookbooks as well as my actual gothic cruise blog vlog because this is the dress that i did wear for the masquerade ball and i decorated it up with like some a vinyl corset and a crown and you really even bigger sleeves than this but it is such a cute dress it's you know black lace with the little like reddish pink flowers all over it it is a disney princess dress that i did find thrifting and it's got a like this nice little high low hem if you can see that there it's really low in the front like right, right above the knees in the front but then in the back it goes down to my ankles not that you can completely see that but And then for accessories to goth it up a little bit, I did add this little tie on shrug that is either from Romwe or Shein, I can't remember which, <laughs> but it's got a uh, skull lace. So I thought, you know, the lace and the lace, but add some skulls. And then this belt that just has two, I think they're goldish skulls on it, but I think this dress can go gold or silver. 
Uh, my necklace is silver though, <laughs> so I'm mixing metals. Some people don't like that. I'm okay with it. <laughs> but uh, the, it is a choker that I did make. As you can see, it's got some holographic scales to you know keep in that spring spirit because it's got all the, the pretty pinks and blues in it. The little lock. I'll give you a closer look of the lace. So yeah, that's this outfit. We only have one more to go. And actually, I totally forgot. I'll be right back. I forgot my black witch hat. <laughs> I've got this, uh, you know, I've got the witch hats in lots of colors. I have a red one, a black one, that purple one you just saw. I think I might have one other one. I can't remember. Maybe not. Maybe that's all I have. Maybe I just have red, black, and purple. But um, I, anyway, lots of witch hats. But this one does have another bat chain I made with a cute little bat on it. Or hat chain with a bat on it. Um, this I would also possibly wear with the last outfit that had the bat skirt because the bat tie in. But... Now we can move on to our very last outfit. And our final thrifted spring goth outfit is this awesome purple dress. The brand is something like MXXN. I, I know I've gotten that brand off of Amazon before, but I found this dress new with tags at, a th at the thrift store at Goodwill. And then I paired that with my favorite Killstar belt. I actually had to crazy glue the zipper shut because it kept splitting. <laughs> Like you can, you can clip it in the back so you don't need the zipper to function. <sighs> Thank goodness. Because it's like my favorite belt and every time I put it on it would just pop open. <laughs> it's like, I guess it didn't do that when I first got it. So I'm guessing it just de deteriorated over time. But I crazy glued it shut. So now I have no problems at all with it. <laughs> and then I also put on a similar but different pentagram harness. And again, the little wrist cuffs and my purple witch hat with my purple witch chain. And I believe it actually does say witch. <laughs> so it's really cute. All right. That is my thrifted gothic spring lookbook. Please let me know what you thought about all this down in the comments below. Which outfit was your favorite outfit? Which uh, outfit did you not like as much? Let me know so I don't go out in public that like that. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. And if you did enjoy this, please give me a thumbs up. If you didn't enjoy it, of course, you can give me a thumbs down. And please tell me all about it in the comments below. And please subscribe to the channel. I hope everyone is just staying happy, healthy, and safe in this incredibly crazy world we're living in. And I will talk to you all soon. Bye-bye.